Gale, uh, the Gale Reference Collection is a series of print publications that the library has uh, purchased in electronic format. So what I mean by that is that the library has a series of print publications published by Gale, wonderful encyclopedias, uh, subject encyclopedias that we keep on campus in our Springfield, Springfield location. But we also provide access to a series of those print publications online. And this collection is what you use to search that. You can see that it defaults to an advanced search, which is a series of search boxes, in which you can tell it where to search. You can search by publication title, by subject, by keyword, and you can build a search in a more complicated or complex way. Some researchers like to do that. You can also see there's a basic search up top, which you can just type in your search term and click on the uh, search button to the right, and it will do a search for you. If you scroll down, you'll see a series of, of options to limit your results. Generally speaking, most people are going to come to Gale and they're going to type in their search and they're going to see the results and go from there. So let's type in a search that's a little bit general, like the, the word hunger. Now, students may be researching various aspects of hunger. So there is the purely medical standpoint. So you can see the very first result here is the Gale Encyclopedia of Medicine. It is the uh, fifth edition. It was published in 2005, and this particular entry for hunger and undernutrition is four pages long. The next entry is from the Social History of the American Family, an encyclopedia, and that is about food shortages and hunger. The next one is about environmental change, so that's an encyclopedia. And again, they'll provide the date that it was published as part of this list of results. The Worldmark Encyclopedia of Nation. This is the Food and Agricultural Organization of the United Nations, the FAO. So each of these results has been given to you because you've searched a word like hunger and it tries to pull up relevant results. In this case, it pulled up 735 results total and it has ranked them by relevance, which means that the items that show up first are the ones that should be most relevant to your search. You can change the way that you show your results by the document title or by publication date, et cetera. In this case, let's take a look at the hunger and undernutrition entry. Again, you can, you can see lots of information about the publication itself, the authors, the editor, the date, the publisher, Gale, a Cengage company. If you scroll down, you can see you have options to change the font size. You can have it read the entry to you. And you also have options to save this entry to Google Drive, to your uh, Microsoft OneDrive. You can email it or you can download it to your computer. To the far right, you have other search options, things like related subjects, or you can have articles that may be related to this particular search. So there's an entry for malnutrition in the Gale Encyclopedia of Children's Health, Infancy through Adolescence 2016. So you could just go to the right, click that, and see it yet another entry. So the entry itself, it's fairly lengthy. It has nice description of the item. It gives some risk factors, causes, and symptoms for this particular issue. And then down at the bottom, it provides additional resources like books, periodical articles, and it has various websites. At the very bottom, you can provide, uh, you can get your source, MLA, APA. You can select that, and then you can copy it by clicking right or right, right on your mouse. Select copy, and you can paste that into your works cited. That is a basic search for... Gale reference sources. If you have any questions, please contact your Lincoln Land librarian.